And you fall generally in the area of when he became president. But yun nga, um, doon ba kayo nagkakilala o earlier pa? Well, I was just uh, a bystander mm. because I was, I'm a product of the first quarter storm. And therefore, Activista. Fidel V. Ramos, <laughs> the PCINP. <laughs> And I would not want to cross his path. Mm-hmm. Parang ganon. Tapos naging presidente. Uy, ano ito? Eh, nag, nag-mayor ako. Mm-hmm. So parang sabi ko, my God, I will be under a president mm-hmm. who's from the military. So yung initial ano mo? Initial ko is, my God. But I said, okay. Mm-hmm. Uh, the year, the regime of Ibagsak, Ibagsak is over. Mm-hmm. And there's a call for nation building to support mm-hmm. government. Mm-hmm. And now I'm elected mayor. Mm-hmm. I should be supporting government. Mm-hmm. Okay. But okay. government without necessarily identifying government with President Fidel V. Ramos. Kasi nga. Kasi nga na, sa other may side stigma, ako. May stigma. Oh, oh, sayo. Medyo takot ako na ano. And especially so when I found out that the military. The description of the military in my place in southern Luzon, I'm from mm-hmm. Quezon, mm-hmm. Uh, says that I have community-based support. So ano yon? In English lang. Bak iba yung ibig sabihin nun. Because at that time, ah. that was still the height of the insurgency in my town. Mm-hmm. And any kind and all kinds of, uh, sabi ko nga, mga lahat ng insurrectos nagkaroon sa aming bayan. Mm-hmm. Yung mga hukbala. Mm-hmm. You know, I was born in that kind of environment. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And then I, my father was a politician and mm-hmm. he was mayor. Mm-hmm. And uh, my father told me that I, will be, I would be restricted because they found my name in the list of those uh, who would, could kidnap some people in the town. Huh? And I was like, ganun yung klase ng kasaysay. Yung but that was the brush, I had a brush with the Hukmalahaps. I mean, that's the closest to mm. it. So, in my mind, there is something wrong somewhere. Mm. Why mm. will these people try to kidnap more or less the people, in, the children of the people in power? Mm. Mm. And then, true enough, my, you know, the the brother the sister of my best friend were kidnapped and killed oh my. so <laughs> that's the kind of <laughs> conflict that i had pero hook balahap ka mo yon and hook balahap pa yon oh, hook balahap oh, pa yon oh. yun yung regime na i was born into pero 50s yun, <laughs> pero yun yung pero yun din yung hinahunting ni na FBR at that time now ito nga yung parang tadhana ba <laughs> And so, um, I went to Manila, I studied, mm-hmm. I took up law, I passed the bar in the Philippines, I went to the U.S., and I got my license as a lawyer in New York, mm. and then I went back. But in between, I was uh, involved in activism, mm. and in fact, we had our protest graduation in yeah. college in St. Paul, oh. and I led it. Mm. Mm. Yeah, you were you were you were in the protest movement. And yes, that was the height also of yes. martial law. Yes, mm-hmm. when I became mayor, of course, there was the Takori, and that's the reason why I entered <laughs> politics. <laughs> when when did you 88. become mayor? Eighty-eight. So, oh, oh, that's oh, ninety-two. Yeah. Si PFDR, uh-huh. di ba? Eight. So, oh, koring, koring nakikita yun. mo pa ba si, nakikita, na-meet mo na ba si FBR at that time? O it's ilag, every from afar ka? because I was there at EDSA 1. Ah, okay. Diba? Ah. So, talagang hero. Pero may reservation pa rin ako eh. Kasi hmm. military yan eh. Paano yun? <laughs> hmm. oh, paano, oh. Paano, paano ako? Paano kami? Hmm. So, hmm. yun. And then when I became mayor, uh, of course, I was working with the ILG hmm. kasi sila yung parang nag nagsi-shepherd sa inyo, di ba? Mm-hmm. Sa amin, local officials. Mm-hmm. And, he was SND, uh, National Defense. No? Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, oh. So, sige lang, okay lang. But mm-hmm. his name was already being mentioned at the ILG. DILG? Oh. DILG, ha? Pati DILG? Oo, kasi sabi niya, may, mag, yung, parang sinasabi nilang, uh, we will be having more leaders uh, in the in the 
future. Pero hindi nila sinasabi magpipresidente at all. But mm -hmm. probably, he, uh, uh, everybody was looking at him as somebody who, who is a leader. Mm -hmm. So when he, you know, so... So, nung, so nag lead nung nag naging presidente siya. na siya. Nung nag, be, dun nung nag anunsyo mo na siya, natatakbo siya. Amitra ako. <laughs> ah, RVM yun? ako. Party, you were LDP, LDP ako. Ah, okay. Siya na yung oh. pangulo. O, siya na yung pangulo eh. Mm, Sabi lang, na. Ah. oh, kailangan mag-produce tayo ng mga bagong leaders, mga bata. Mm -hmm. Well, I was young then. Mm -hmm. O, oh, so, sige, okay lang naman sa akin. Mm -hmm. ah, kaya lang sabi ko, ayoko kasi hindi naman ako bumoto kay FBR. Mm -hmm. Nakakayahan mo, balimbing ako. <laughs> Ay, hindi, hindi, wala. Oh. Hindi ang ganyan. Mm -hmm. And then I went on. And then, that's how I got involved in the league. The League of, uh, league of Municipalities. Okay. First okay. in my province, mm -hmm. and then, nag-national na ako. So, At ako naman yung super fan. What? Ni FBR. <laughs> Yun nga eh. Convert ako talaga. From, from one end to the yes, other. Yes, yes, yes. What turn? What turned you? Bakit? Alam Anong... Mo, ibang klaseng tao yan eh. Why? Ibang klaseng leader yan. Kasi yung, siyempre yung mga no, notion ko noon, pag yung national leader, parang hindi hands-on, utos lang ng utos. Mm -hmm. Eh, ito, hindi eh. Pati Jerry, binabasa, nagma-marginal note in red. <laughs> so, I had the privilege of seeing those notes. Mm -hmm. So, I said, iba itong mamang ito. At saka na, baka organized in his discussion, mm -hmm. in his, in the way he presided the meetings. Sabi ko, pati mga mayors, pinagpapapatulan. Mm -hmm. You know, he'd listen to us. I said, mayors. Like, mayors. So he would usually uh, bring the mayors to him. Ano bang mama ito? And then, grabe. Mm -hmm. Military. So I would never expect him to be joking. Mm -hmm. Pero ako, siguro sobrang, sobra akong admire, naging admire niya. Convert na ang tawag ko. <laughs> Kahit na gaano ka corny yung mga jokes niya na recycled naman, <laughs> tumataw pa ako. Binibili ko pa. You know, iba yung feel niya eh. May feel siya sa baba. Ah, yun yung difference that I saw. Okay, okay. so that's uh, what ano? Yun yung... That I was able to identify myself mm -hmm. as a local official na ang presidente pala, pwedeng ganun. Hindi lang, my feel. hindi lang national. Hindi, my feel. At saka, bakit alam na alam niya yung areas dun sa bayan ko? <laughs> And then I found out. <laughs> Sierra Madre was his first assignment as a young lieutenant. Oh. And okay. that included my town. Oh. And my town had a Stalin University up in the Sierra Madre. Stalin University? Oo. Oh, oh. As in... Doon napupunta yung mga, mm -hmm. oo, doon mga nagpupunta. Well, there's no structure, mm -hmm. but they converge there. Mm -hmm. And uh, mm -hmm. so yun. And then, sabi ko, bakit ganun? Alam na alam niyo yung mga info doon sa amin. Mm -hmm. And do you know that when he was about to launch the first agrarian reform community, mm -hmm. he chose my town, that particular area in the Sierra Madre. Mm -hmm. Oh, Just oh. to show the people that, hey, government is here. Mm -hmm. We are reaching out to you. Mm -hmm. And he put up the school mm -hmm. in that area. Wow. And that's how we were able to uh, break the backbone of the insurgency in my area. Sinasabi niya sa amin, servisyo ng gobyerno, dalin niyo dyan. So, talagang... No? So, admirable. Mm -hmm. Can I clarify? Anong, di ba may category ang mga munisipyo? First, two, oh. six. Anong level yung munisipyo? Fifth class. Ah, so, ano, municipality. Medyo nasa baba pa. But you know, I found out that even my uh, municipal council officials, mm -hmm. they were paying more taxes to the NPA than to the government. <laughs> Imagine that. Oh. Oh, Ganon. Oh, oh. And yet, yun nga, no? The first, the first ARC, mm -mm, and then he started bringing governance 
to talaga pinafollow up yan ah. ganong klaseng i mean makikita very strategic ang mga decisions niya action niya mm-hmm. at saka you'd you'd feel that there is a vision not just see mm-hmm. but feel mm-hmm. and that you're part of it mm-hmm. Philippines 2000 it says it all so there's something to look forward to ah may roadmap mm yun yung naging feeling namin so talagang kakapit ka doon uh-huh. and was that something that resonated also with with the other members of the league of yes because remember there was uh, a new breed Mm-hmm. of local officials mm-hmm. who ran and won the elections after EDSA won. Oh, no, ito yung, oh, oh. yung mga nasa private sector, mga dati ng mm-hmm. uh, members of the first quarter storm. Mm-hmm. Ano na sila? Kami yun. Mm-hmm. We gave up our comfortable lives in mm-hmm. Manila. Private, private practice. Our private business. practice. In fact, my uh, salary as mayor was even lower than the salary of the janitor in, my, in the law office where I came from. Oh my. Pero parang, parang ano eh, the call was there. Mm-hmm. And then, nung dumating si PFVR, of mm-hmm. course, parang na-crystallize mm-hmm. the, the yearnings that we had when mm-hmm. we were in activism. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And... Uh, Iba eh, iba no. eh. So he was striking the right notes. Yes. Uh-huh. Which, which, Decentralization, I mean, he was ah, saying okay. those things. Remember, okay. this, these are the buzzwords during mm-hmm. his time. Decentralization, okay. empowerment, uh-huh. gender sensitivity. Mm-hmm. I mean, these were the things that we were fighting for and mm-hmm. our advocacy mm-hmm. was really on this mm-hmm. principles. Mm-hmm. So parang nag-jive kami, nag-gel kami lahat. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yun. Tug, nag, ano, nag, nag, tugma, nag, tugma, 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 bumangga talaga. Mm-hmm. I cannot imagine myself having entered politics and become a local official uh, in any other time. Uh, so this was the best time. This was the best time. Mm-hmm. Talaga. Mm-hmm. And it, if I remember also correctly, ma'am, um, the local government code yes was passed. 1991. So, patapos na yung kay President Aquino. Uh-oh. And it was left to PFVR. Yes. To for the IRR, for the f- initial implementation, for the mm-hmm. modeling, mm-hmm. and we were there. But that's also, so I suppose that's also the reason why it was very important for him to bring the League of Governors, the League of yes. Cities, the League yes. of Municipalities. He marshaled us all. Not just, usually kasi when you are cold, it's because of politics. Mm-hmm. Hindi eh. Pagpapupuntahin ka doon, maglilecture siya ng tungkol sa trabaho mo mm-hmm. and how to put the systems in place. Mm-hmm. Iba yun, ibang dating sa amin noon. And yet, a lot of you were not even politically associated with him. Oh no, I never voted for him. Oh. That's the reason why I was so sad When the cha-cha did not succeed. <laughs> and then I, I went to, he, to see him and I said, and I was almost in tears, I said, why? Mm-hmm. Because, Mr. President, I was hoping that I would be able to vote for you. <laughs> I never voted for you. Gano'ng oh, kahalaga oh. yung ano? Let me let me get back to decentralization and oh, local empowerment. Local autonomy, no, local empowerment. Autonomy. Gaano kahalaga sa ano? Tula don. In in your case, you were a uh, fifth uh, fifth class uh, Mm-mm. municipality. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Why it was, was it important? It was very important because noon kasi parang my father was mayor, mm-hmm. so kung ano utos sa taas, yun lang ang pwede mong gawin. Mm. But the empowerment thing. Uh, you know, all of a sudden, we realized that we are co-players and co-workers in government. And there were decisions that we could do. Mm-hmm. There were a lot of decisions that we could do. 
because of that empowerment thing, because of the decentralization. Mm -hmm. Plus, we were given um, a, a share of the money from the national government mm -hmm. that we can spend on projects that we conceptualized. Mm -hmm. And we're seeing the implementation of the project that we discussed. Yeah, specific uh, oh, area. So, mo. parang nagkaroon tuloy ng, ah, uh, well, yung self-esteem mo tumaas. Uh, na pwede ka pala. Uh, uh, and as FVR would say, in your little towns, you are the president. Well, syempre, so, uh, naman. you'd stand up several feet tall. Kasi mm -hmm. ikaw yung president. Mm -hmm. You know, that's how, that's how, he brought in messages. He sent the messages. Mm -hmm. Talagang, kaya sabi na, parang hindi presidente, pero presidente presidente. Mm -hmm. And then mm -hmm. he started, remember, mm -hmm. the, the development projects, the development the areas, the mm -hmm. eco zones. Yeah, yeah. That was real decentralization. That was the real reform. Oh, yung oh, oh. binabasa mm -hmm. nila, dinadala oh, mo sa, oh, oh, sa lokal yung ano. Oh, oh. At saka, naging economic hub ang maraming lokal. Oh. And that's important because if you want before, unlike before, mm -hmm. if you want a job, you have to come to Manila. All of a sudden, you're seeing factories all over. No need your to. economic mm -hmm. zones. Mm -hmm. So, pwede ka nang pumila doon. Mm -hmm. So, ito talaga spurred the economic development mm -hmm. outside of Metro Manila. Mm -hmm. You know, it was a revolution. And oh. that's how we saw it. Kaya parang excited kami, the young blood at that time. Mm -hmm. And uh, siguro, rev revolutionary temperament that we had. Mm -hmm. So, parang we were coming just in time. Ironic because it came from a soldier. Yes! <laughs> yes, it's true. We never wanted to be uh, led by soldiers. Mm -hmm. We didn't like to be mil akala namin militarization yung tawag doon eh. Mm -hmm. But just to fi find out, mm -hmm. he brought with him the discipline of a soldier. Kita namin yan. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But he also brought with him mm -hmm. the heart of a leader. Mm. and the mind of a leader, mm -hmm. siya yun. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. One of the governance tools, uh, if I remember correctly, was naalala mo yung ano, dinadala niya yung cabinet meetings Ay, oh, sa mga oh. probinsya. Oh, Ikaw oh. ba yung nakasama ka dun sa mga yun? <laughs> nakasama ako, kung minsan nga, ahead pa ako. Because oh. I was working with Gabby Claudio as a political uh, affairs mm -hmm. uh, President secretary. LMP when I was president of the LMP, uh, si Gabi was practically, I also learned a lot from him. Mm -hmm. So if the president would go to a place, mm -hmm. I would uh, have my meeting with the mayors mm -hmm. ahead of the president's uh, visit. Mm -hmm. So, hindi talaga so ano? I, could, I could more or less clean some issues, clarify mm -hmm. some issues. Mm -hmm. But these things are useful, this... Uh, uh, meetings are very useful, I found out later, mm -hmm. because uh, instead of the president receiving it for the first time, mm -hmm. we are able to clarify. So, oh. mas receptive na yung minds ng local officials when mm -hmm. he'd mm -hmm. do the visits. Or may anon rin, may proposed solution. Oh, oh, and I always share it with my mayors. Mm -hmm. You know, if you want to air something to PFBR, mm -hmm. to the president, you must be sure that when you have your problem, you have your proposed solution. Hindi pwedeng problema. Hindi pwedeng problema ang ibibigay mo sa kanya. At saka sabi ko, remember yung CSW na sinasabi niya. Oh my God. Better do your homework. Mm -hmm. CSW being complete, complete sa... staff work. Hindi... Pati ikaw nahawa doon? Ay, naku, hanggang ngayon, daladala ko yun. <laughs> CSW. You know, nearly everybody talks about it. Tell me how it influenced you. Me? In my office, I always say that. The leader, like me when I was mayor, when you present something to me, my role is approve, disapprove. Mm -hmm. If I can do that, that means you have complied with the CSW. Mm -hmm. But if I have a lot of questions, a lot of details, that means you have not done your work. 
Mayor pa lang ako, ha? Ganun na. Pagkakarating ko sa amin, may bago na naman ako. Natutunan kay FBR. <laughs> you know, even the, the national anthem. Huh? Huh? What I learned from him, mm-hmm. you don't have the canned songs. You only have the music and you sing it yourself. Bakit? Yan ang, because it must come from the heart when you sing the national anthem. Ganun. Hanggang ngayon, ganyan ako. Yung ganun kasimpleng detalye. Oo. Oh, it, it stuck in my mind like mm-hmm. anything. Mm-hmm. Ano nga ako eh, convert. <laughs> okay. What about the foreign visits? Nakasama ka rin sa mga foreign visits? Hindi ako nakasama ah, sa foreign okay. visits kasi. Okay. Pero, uh, for example, in the foreign fu- funds, mm-hmm. like uh, the USAID funds, mm-hmm. in one in the the management of the funds for the local officials mm-hmm. uh, it used to be named gold mm-hmm. and i was part of the steering committee i co-chaired it mm-hmm. together with uh, the official from the embassy uh, because uh, uh, because of LNP. my involvement now. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. okay mm-hmm. talaga grabe ibang klase saka yung hindi ka pa dem- when you work you have to be very focused. That's one thing I learned from him. And you don't leave that work until it is completed, no matter how difficult. Kaya wala bitaw. Parang ganun. Ewan ko, ang dami ko natutunan sa kanya talaga eh. Ikaw ba'y nagigising ka rin ng alas 4? Ah, that's normal. That's normal. Just like him. Yes. In fact, until now, I would sleep if I sleep at before 10, mm-hmm. it's sure that I'll wake up at 2 o'clock oh to work. <laughs> and no backlog. I learned that from him. No backlog. Mm-hmm. That's what I learned from him. Huh? Okay. Convert talaga. <laughs> Convert talaga ako. <laughs> okay. Ah. Meron ka ba ng mga ano? <laughs> No. Yung mga visit sa mga iba-ibang Lugar. provinces, okay? Oo. Sakay ka ng aeroplano, sakay oh, ka oh, 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 oh. Meron ba nga near misses ba? Ah, uh, well, <laughs> hindi naman. Pero ito ang experience ko sa kanya. Uh-huh. Huwag kang tatanga-tanga, maiiwan ka. <laughs> <laughs> yung oh, mga ganon. Oo oh, nga, no? move pa lagi. Ibang klase. Ibang klase talaga yan. How, how did that work ethic? Influence, influence you as well. I mean, you know, well, early... Na-enhance early. ako sa how to organize my work. Okay. Like, when I... Before I go to sleep, mm-hmm. I must have my to-do list. Yon. The following day, mm-hmm. I would know which is my priority. Mm-hmm. And then, chak, chak, chak. May red pen ka rin. <laughs> Meron, pero nahihiya akong gamitin. <laughs> Parang paka- pakiramdam ko, that's presidential color. <laughs> Talaga? <laughs> okay. My, my, my next question is, you, you touched on it uh, earlier. Eh. What was... You, uh, okay. Um, your, your political star actually rose and... From shine, there. From... from uh, initially, ayaw mong ma-associate sa kanya until, as uh, she said, he became convert a... Convert nga eh. Convert Hindi na. fan ha. Oh. Convert. Oh. The, during during his administration. Uh, so what? Is he a role model? Is he your political godfather? Uh, an- anong anong All rolled up into one. Kasi, I refer to his writings, I mean, to his books. <laughs> And uh, I always recall the incidents mm-hmm. and how he handled the incidents mm-hmm. and the crisis. Mm-hmm. Oh my God! Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. His his best. You know, when he manages crisis, uh, you know that's how I learned that you should be the first to be at the place where the crisis is. You cannot you cannot manage crisis mm-hmm. from somewhere. From afar. No. Mm-hmm. Be there mm-hmm. and have the control. Mm-hmm. You know palagi yung sinasabi. Mm-hmm. Check 
who should be there, mm -hmm. who should be in touch, mm -hmm. who should be on deck. Mm -hmm. And it's very important for a local and, official. You know? Yes, always anticipate. That's his word. Mm -hmm. Anticipate. Mm -hmm. So you know that example, you know that typhoon is coming. Mm -hmm. So buffer stock for your rice, mm -hmm. buffer stock for this. Mm -hmm. And that's what I learned a lot <laughs> on crisis management from him. He came in. Oh. oh. Electric. Yes, power. power. Yes. Oh. mga Solomonic decisions. Eh. Mm -hmm. And when you do your crisis management, mm -hmm. you cannot have a personal agenda, not even for the sake of your personal safety. Because mm -hmm. otherwise, wala kang magagawa eh. O family, family mm -hmm. safety. Talagang, you will have to manage the crisis as though, wala yun. Wala kang pamilya, wala, mm -hmm. wala kang sarili. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then you'd be able to concentrate. Wow. Okay. Ito, nabanggit mo na eh. Uh, was he able to accomplish everything that he set out to do six years? Well, w I'm sure uh, he had more, he, had, he, he wanted to do more things. Mm -hmm. But for me, he has accomplished a lot. Mm -hmm. And that should have been the goal. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't exactly know if Personally, that was his goal, but in so far as us, mm -hmm. the Filipino local leaders, mm -hmm. it was a goal that he has achieved. Mm -hmm. Why am I saying that? Mm -hmm. The fundamentals of economics, mm -hmm. he was able to lay down. Mm -hmm. uh, the political, the political leadership, mm -hmm. or the political respect, mm -hmm. he was able to put that in the map of the world. Oh, no. Iba yun eh. Yeah. Iba yeah. yun. Proud ka na Pinoy ka. Proud ka na Pinoy ka. Of course, during the time of Tita Cory, everybody was proud. Mm -hmm. But this time, iba yun. Iba rin yung time ni Tita Cory. Mm -hmm. Pero the challenge was more for FBR. Mm -hmm. Because he came in, uh, people were still a little bit euphoric. Mm -hmm. But the problems already are there and real mm -hmm. power. Mm -hmm. Everything was in shambles. Oh. Oh. And some people had doubts mm -hmm. whether FBR could do it. Mm -hmm. then, probably some people did not know that he had his MBA, mm -hmm. his master's. Mm -hmm. At saka, no, you know, when he plans and he thinks, mm -hmm. yung discipline ng military nandun, mm -hmm. but you know, the mind, mm -hmm. the heart, and the soul mm -hmm. you'd see in his plans. Mm -hmm. He was also an engineer, so I suppose yes. builder. No? At saka, no, yung discipline, ibang discipline ng engineers eh. Mm -hmm. Naalala mo, may mga part CPM, so may goal and how to get there and Process. timeline. Oh. 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 Yung timeline, ha? Mm -hmm. when you discuss with him, you be ready with your timeline. Hindi pwedeng basta idea. The how-tos and the timelines mm -hmm. are very important to him. Do, do, and in doable. Oh. And in, yeah. oh. Okay. But there were attempts for him to, well, to allow him to seek a second term, you know, basically through amendments in the Constitution. I was at the forefront. Pirma or People's Initiative? <laughs> <laughs> I was at the forefront of Pirma. Oh, okay. Kami nandun nila, oh, bet magtanganan. We yes. honestly believe that he would be good for the country. Mm -hmm. And uh, he would be good to have another term. Ano yan? So six years or abbreviated? Three years lang? Parang ano? six years yung ina namin. Re-election once. Yun ah, yung okay. ano natin eh. So uh -oh. one more term, uh -oh. six one years. More term. But tingnan mo yun ah. He was very sensitive to people. Nung... Sabi nga niya, kasi ako, parang umiyak na ako, bakit, bakit, why do we have to stop? Ganon ako ng ganon. Mm -hmm. Tapos Gabi Claudio was explaining to me, 
ah, you just don't know. FBI is very sensitive to these things. If he thinks that will not be good for the people, in terms of it has become very controversial, sabihin niya huminto na. Huwag kayong ganyan. Para, oy, huwag kayong ganyan, hindi nakakabuti sa atin yan. Ah, yeah, but because it was diverting yeah. political instead At saka it was dividing the country. Uh, it was dividing the country. Oh. Diba, kanya-kanya na. Mm -hmm. Well, um, the Marcos uh, factor was there in the sense that they were afraid that some quarters were very much uh, mm -hmm. afraid that uh, FBR may continue for as long as mm -hmm. You know, uh, those things, mm. oh, those things, pero ano yun eh, kami naman, mm. who worked with him very closely, that's baseless. Para uh, ako naniniwala, hindi walang batayan yung mga fears na gano'n, na he mm. will be forever mm -hmm. uh, president, he would declare martial law, he would, hindi, hindi, hindi siya gano'n. Mm -hmm. And he, he gano'n. eventually decided, I think shortly after Mrs. Aquino and... Cardinal Sin mm -mm. led a rally. Mm -mm. And then after that, he said, Tama na, huwag na. Ito na yung... Ito na yung umiiyak na nga. Oo, oo. Oh, oh. Eh, di, ta 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 natawa nga siya. Oh. So, oh, so, why? Because, Mr. President, I want to vote for you. I have never <laughs> voted for you. <laughs> Tapos tawa siya na tawa. Oo, oh, oo. Oh. Were there, ano, ano? Because I remember there were... Local governments were coming up with their own uh, separate resolutions. Parang manifesto. The, oh, oh, oh the talaga. President. Talaga naman eh. But you know, some quarters say, eh, kasi mga politiko yan. Kaya yan, madaling papirmahin. Mm. No, it's not. <laughs> kasi imagine, it was the first time that we felt the, we experienced decentralization, local autonomy, empowerment. Mm -hmm. These are not empty buzzwords. Mm -hmm. They were really being implemented. Mm -hmm. So, syempre kami mga mayor say, ano, kailangan talaga natin si FVR mm -hmm. and let him continue. Mm -hmm. Were there attempts to make him reconsider yung decision niya na... Ang daming resolutions na dumating. I should know because I was the national president. Mm -hmm. And they were, they were even saying, pwede pa bang mag... Oh, eh, dating na dating ang mga resolutions ng mga lokal. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Pero... Pero siya, ano siya? Oo, oh, oh, iba siya. Eh. Iba siya. Mm -hmm. Sabi niya, nothing that should divide the people. Ano, talaga statesman siya. Mm -hmm. Na, ano, no? Oh, he, had, he had the vision. Oo, oh, 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 talaga. Okay. He was holding on. <laughs> he had a close call, if you remember. 96. Sa? Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Worried kay na? Of course. Of course. Bakit? We were very much worried. Paano nang mangyayari? Parang, you know, everybody was uh, uh, caught the temp his tempo. Mm -hmm in uh, improving, in development. Mm -hmm. And then, yung leader mo, biglang may, meron ditong, ano ba yun, carotid? Mm -hmm. Di ba, ganun yun? Blocked artery. Blocked artery. Mm -hmm. And uh, I remember it was December because my town was awarded as the cleanest and greenest municipality oh, yeah. mm -hmm. in the Philippines. And the awarding was at uh, Luneta. Mm -hmm. And then, that's why that's how that's how I learned, and I was told the president would not come. Mm -hmm. It was Mrs. Ramos who came because oh. he was sick. Oh, oh ganun yun. <laughs> yung mga ganun ba? Hindi ko nakakalimutan. <laughs> At pinapunta pa niya si Mrs. Ramos. Oh, despite na. No? Mm -mm. Well, 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 it was a close call, but you know, shortly about a day or well, so after. Well, there's destiny. Ambilis na, no? Saka, it's destiny. Oh, it's oh. destiny for him. Mm -hmm. Did uh, the prospect of Joseph Estrada <laughs> becoming president too early worried you? I don't know. I, I 
it was somehow deep inside me I knew somehow mm -hmm. FBR would not go ah, okay. mm -hmm. because I've always believed that the presidency is destiny mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yun, yun lang yung pinanghawakan ko mm -hmm. parang okay magka, kung magkakasakit man siya siguro may sakit lang mm -hmm. pero he's still destined mm -hmm. to be <laughs> okay towards the latter part of well Patapos na yung kanyang term. Mm -mm. Member ka na ng lakas nun. Oh, I'm, you were already... And eventually became the executive director. Yes, yes. Mm -mm. Of the uh -oh. party, ano? Mm -mm. Um, <clears throat> Joseph Estrada said that he was going to run for president. Mm -mm. Ano, yung, <laughs> ano yung strategy para ng lakas para... I mean... And, extremely popular you know candidate like Joseph Estrada and eh ako kasi party man o party woman traditional kasi uh -huh. parang well I learned that from my father mm -hmm. what how what and how it is to be loyal to your party mm -hmm. so kung ako parang I was born into a liberal party mm -hmm. uh, family so mm -hmm. all throughout mm -hmm. Tapos, nun nga, kung sino ang inominate ng lakas. lakas kayo. Pero there were two of them, if you remember. Yes. Diba? Uh, Speaker JDD and, and uh, Secretary De Villa. De Villa. I was De Villa. Oh, okay. But okay. I told Manong uh, Joe mm -hmm. and FVR mm -hmm. that Southern Luzon yan eh. And oh. I am from Southern Luzon. Oh. Oh. So I told them that... Uh, I'd uh, be working with the camp of uh, Secretary de Villa. Mm. But whoever the Lakas will eventually put up as, ca as a candidate, mm -hmm. I will be there. So, nung nagsabi si FVR, di ba may mga voting-voting yes, pa? Yes, yes. O oh, may convention pa? Mm -hmm. Nung sinabi ni FVR, the standard bearer would be Joe. Mm -hmm. oh. Diretso ako dun sa, from the province, ha, from Quezon, mm -hmm. dumiretso ako kay Se Secretary De Villa. Mm -hmm. And I told him, Manong, mm -hmm. the President has spoken. Mm -hmm. I am going to support uh, the Speaker. Okay. Ganun ako ka-loyal. Hindi naman nagka... <laughs> Wala. Hindi naman nagka... No? Okay. At okay. saka sa akin, that time, survey, mataas, mababa, ay eh, sinabi ng aming boss mm -hmm. na... Si JDV ang susuportahan. Stand by. So, yun, no. Mm -hmm. Ganun kasimple yung utak ko. Mm -hmm. When it comes to party matters. Okay. FPR, well, ended his term in 98. You are still in government. Well, I was mayor. Oh, yeah, but... Eventually, I ran, uh -oh. but I lost. Uh, for a higher office, oh, yeah. Uh -huh. But yeah, you uh, you became solicitor. Ah yes, that's oh. the time. And then after that, I became the executive director of, uh, of La Caz oh, oh. under uh, GMA, President who G. was then vice president. Oh, oh. So na ako, dun ako. But isila naman yung si Speaker uh, JDB. Uh, FVR mm -hmm. and GMA, mm -hmm. they agreed unanimously that I would be taken as the executive director mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and that Lakas would be under the direct uh, supervision, of course, mm -hmm. of under the leadership of uh, GMA. Mm -hmm. So, she is the highest ranking, highest ranking official oh, oh. of the party. Si oh. FBR so, I'm going to stay in And you've stayed in government service? Yeah, until GMA left. Oh, oh. Yes. In various capacities. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. But you still meet with FBR? Well, I attend his book launch. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but so whenever I can. Oh, okay. And of course, okay. the birthday. Oh, oh. Oh. May value pa? May value pa siya as a senior statesman? Saan? Sa akin? Oo. Oh, oh. oh, oo naman. Mm -hmm. Ay, kaya nga, hinahabol-habol ko pa yan. <laughs> Ani, Kahit nga narinig ko na yung mga jokes na for several <laughs> decades, tumatawa pa ako. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. No, may value talaga. Mm -hmm. 
you seek advice? Yeah, and you know, just to listen to him. Talagang ano eh, iba eh. Iba talaga. Meron ka bang ano? Meron ka bang? Do you have a most memorable FDR moment? Yung pag naalala mo siya, ito lagi yung... Nung ano, nung umiiyak ako kasi hindi matutuloy yung cha-cha. <laughs> hindi ko makalimutan yun. Talaga. Tapos, because I requested for appointment mm -hmm. with him in the palace. Mm -hmm. that was, tapos, nung sinabi ko sa kanya, I was so serious na. Mm -hmm. Sabi ko kasi, Sir, I want, Mr. President, I want to be able to vote for you. Tapos tumawa, mm -hmm. huh, hindi pa rason yun. <laughs> mm -hmm. You know, yun talaga. Mm -hmm. Parang nakita ko yung pagka-statesman niya. Yeah. Na, no, hindi ganun. Mm -hmm. oh, it's not because individually you have your parang personal agenda mm -hmm. to push me to run. Mm -hmm. Parang doon ko nakita lalo. Uh, well, a cut above the rest. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Mm -mm. But two last questions. Uh, what do you share with people about him? What do you want people to remember of him? And the other one is, what do you think is his greatest legacy as president? First is the greatest legacy. Mm -hmm. You know, it's the way he interpreted and he implemented the local autonomy. Mm -hmm. Uh, the decentralization of powers. Mm -hmm. He was at the forefront of advocacy and implementation. Mm -hmm. Something that, you know, you'd see the, the openness of the man mm -hmm. to things like this. Mm -hmm. Because otherwise he would have been keeping all the powers. But he was stressing the fact that power must be shared. Mm -hmm. And that's the way governance should be. It's the standards of governance mm -hmm. that I cannot... For me, that's the greatest legacy. Mm -hmm. You know, when he put up the echo zones mm -hmm. in all parts of the country, mm -hmm. that's decentralization. Mm -hmm. That's local autonomy support. And that's empowerment mm -hmm. among all. Mm -hmm. uh, he was running the country because he was president, of course, but he would resonate the things that he would want to see in the countryside mm -hmm. by involving the local officials. Mm -hmm. It's not, I am the president, you do this. No, mm -hmm. I am the president, you have your shared responsibility, and this is, this is the challenge to local officials. Mm -hmm. So we felt very much like part of the presidency. Mm -hmm. And for me, that is something that is very difficult to do. Mm -hmm. It's easier to build all the roads and all the bridges. Mm -hmm. But showing the people, giving them the opportunities to be empowered mm -hmm. and to have the powers and the authority and the funds mm -hmm. decentralized is something else. Mm -hmm. Yun talaga. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What do you want people to remember of him? Well, Meron ka bang sila share with other people? Ah, ito siya. Sobrang dami kasi. Ah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Ang isa is, he's the president of the country, mm -hmm. but he is the barangay captain of the barangays. Ganun yung, mm -hmm. ganun yung kanyang governance eh. Mm -hmm. And you'd feel it. Mm -hmm. Statesman, mm -hmm. pero grassroots wor worker. Ganun yun eh. <laughs> no Something that is difficult to find. I'm good. Thank you very much, ma'am. <laughs>